Hey guys, welcome to a snowy villa part today, and uh, we're away today, and uh, yeah, it's been uh, pretty good in the last uh, few episodes, uh, we had a good victory over Manchester United in midweek, so we want to continue on today, and uh, yeah, we are 9 points clear of Liverpool, who are in 2nd, 10 ahead of United there, uh, Aston Villa, they currently sit uh, on 12 points in ninth position, so about mid-table, not doing too bad, um, but not too good either, you know, so yeah, Mutu captain today, and uh, the team is going to be, uh, there's maybe one or two changes in there, company's going to play this one instead of Gomzi. I think Metzelda's at the back as well. Uh, we've also got uh, Tevez and Mutu are up front. So those are the two up front today. There was nobody... Well, there was quite a few players on uh, good form, but there was nobody really, like, standing out too much, if you know what I mean. So, yeah. But here's Tevez. Oh, with an opportunity there. Missed, though, because uh, the defender took it away, but yeah. Um... So, yeah, there's that scale at the back as well, as you can see here. Carini in goal. Uh, we've got Hoekstra on the left-hand side. Here he is. And uh, Pedretti and Mbami are in there today. And here's Hoekstra with a good opportunity. Oh, it took the shot on on a very tight angle there. He could have possibly placed it into the middle. Went himself. Mm, okay, fair enough. Um, who else we got in there? We've got, uh, I think it was, yeah, Sati is playing this one as well um didn't really want him to but yeah he's going to play it he goes for a shot there and he misses um he's still trying to kind of adapt i reckon if we give it more time he may you know adapt a little bit better but uh, yeah puello is attacking midfield today um as well so there is that so that that's uh that's the team today i uh, can't really say too much more than that um I think we've put out a decent enough team to try and get through this one, so we'll see. But that uh, is stopped there. And uh, here's Petrov. And this is not looking good, but uh, it's going to be back to Karini, who uh, gets it away. Here's Skertle. He's going to go back to Karini this time. And we're just going to pass our way out of trouble. So uh, that's pretty decent. Here is Mutu. He's going. It's Mutu. It's Tevez. Oh, missed. At the last second, it was blocked. Can't believe that. Good opportunity for Tevez to uh, put his one up there, but uh, never mind. Here is Elliot for Aston Villa. And Metzelda's on him. He's going to go out wide. It's blocked out. It's still going here. And this has to be stopped quickly because there was a little bit of space opening up there. And the shot has gone wide. And that was really, really tricky, that, because Petrov was right in front of goal. He had a bit of space to work with to shoot. And uh, here's Mutu once more. It's gone past him. Is Bodner. And that's a good ball. Carini is there, though. I think it was onside as well, that one, had it uh, gone through. So, uh, pretty lucky there. Here's Tevez. What's Tevez going to do? He's going to try and run past this man. He's got the better of him. Tevez is turned into the box. Tevez! Oh, it's the post. It was a good move to trick the uh, defender there. But um, he just couldn't beat the post, unfortunately. That was uh, very unlucky. Here's uh, Pedretti, here's Hookstra, and Bami, out to Puello, Puello's not there, it's going to go out, half an hour in, no goals, very close though, for they are uh, being won, that's over, here, uh, Mutu's going to chase it down, he will get there first, he won't be beaten, and he's going to keep going here as well, he's going to whip this back into the box, but it's not going to end up to anybody, 
Here's Mbemi. It's out to Company this time. And Company's going to go for a whip into the box. Oh, he picks out Mutu. Here's Hoekstra now. All this possession, you'd think something's going to happen sooner or later. Here's Hoekstra once more. He's trying to make some space. Here's Puello. Here's Mutu off target. Well, he kind of scored in the last game from a similar-ish position there. He kind of got it into the box, had to turn, and then just hit it into the far corner against United, and he uh, ended up scoring that one. But that one, it was uh, obviously off target, but it was uh, similar-ish where he received the ball. And uh, Company's won that back again. Here we go. It's Mutu. It's Hookstra. It's Mutu again. Picks out Hookstra. And something's got to happen here. And it's Pedretti who goes for that one. Tevez is going to try and chase it down, but it's going to be cleared again. It, it feels like it's getting closer to this goal now. And it's Puello's effort. I think it was on target, but Sorensen is down to it. And uh, one minute is added on here. And Tevez won the ball back. It's Tevez. It's Mutu. He misses. Well, it's unbelievable, this. All the chances in the world have gone. Mutu on a plate for him there just to bury and he didn't do that that's half time ah it's been good we just haven't got it yet second half is coming straight up Well, uh, yeah, just uh, having a look, though, but it looks like, um, judging by the uh, the interval there and some of the results that do show up, uh, it looks like Liverpool won their game, so at this current moment in time, they are seven points off us now, so we kind of need to... Uh, well, I mean, we don't really need to win. Seven points is still good, but we could do to win this just to keep it as it is. But we'll, uh, we'll see. That's going to be a throw-in. It's going to be a Reading throw-in. Thankfully enough. Here's Tevez. Has he got the better of that man? Yes, he has. It's got to be a goal. It is. All Tevez has worked that. That was lovely done, though. That that really was. Pedretti just runs in there for an easy tap in that. That was great stuff. Tens this defender here. Cuts inside. Pedretti's in the right area just to square it to. Easy stuff. That one. Tevez knew what he was doing there. I don't know what the Villa defence was doing because they just let this happen. As soon as the goalkeeper came out, it was a case of squaring it just before he, uh, he got there to it. So... That is 1-0. That's the uh, one we've been waiting for. We could do with a second just to uh, add a little bit of insurance. Here's Kovac. Uh, it's over the top, but Karini's there. Always alert. And uh, Hookstra's got past one man. Uh, he was trying to uh, put it across. It's nicely done this. Oh, the pass didn't go wide there, unfortunately. There's Modesto. And it's uh, Petrov, and he's probably going to go wide here. He's not going to go wide. Instead, uh, Metzelda's found that pretty easily. Over the top. That is offside by Tevez. Yeah, he would have been well aware, though, had it uh, not been. And uh, here's Bodner. Whipped in. Headed out again. Puella's not going to get there. Sproul's going to throw it back in, though. Here's Petrov. 
Bodner goes into the box but that is headed away quite nicely and, uh, this one's going to go wide and all here's Blondell in there headed out yet again and uh, here's an opportunity ah the ball through didn't go where it needed to be Desto he has given that one up and Asati's had to come back and deal with that Carini is going to boot it far up the field again if he can our changes are going to come along in a moment substitutes preparing and warming up but uh, we need to get the ball forward here if possible that's going to be a foul they are going to come on now Mutu is going to be one of those we're going to rest him for midweek now um, so yeah that's something kind of don't want to do that about the same time I think it kind of needs to be done is that a, a bit of a bit of an off game it's not been totally terrible Rated Tevez a bit higher than him in this game, though. Out of play there. 77 gone. Lennon uh, is on the field as well. That was another change made. And uh, Ben Arthur, who is on high form today, he is on. So yeah, and it was uh, it was Obina. It's Tevez, Tevez for two. There we go. Good stuff. That wraps it up today. It's got to getting his game time now. Good, good, good stuff today. You know what? You can call these goals all you want but their goals nonetheless if you have to square it to score there you go you, you do it you're not going to be complaining later when you've got the three points are you <laughs> here's more the 10 minutes left and this is an opportunity Carini's there yet again not phased by that one too much anyway No, oh, that's not good. Says Sproul, the chance. Oh, saved by Carini. That was Moore. It was it was just all over the place. It fell back to Moore. I think he uh, had his shot on target there, but Carini was in the right area. Crossing in, and that is totally missed there. Been a little bit of a bad day in front of goal for Aston Villa. I think that has to be said, but that's the way it is. And here's Lennon. Lennon's taken off the ball now. That's going to be a ready throw in. Crossed in. Can't find a Beaner. Beaner, uh, surprisingly, actually, it was the. Uh, only forward substitute available in this game today. And here's Lennon still going with the ball. It's Ben Arthur. It's Puello. Uh, still, it, it, it's it's been a good day. It's been a good day for us in the in the office. I would say. And can't pick him out there again. That's it. That's the game there. It, it, it's, it was a tough one. It was a toughie, to be honest. But uh, that is a, uh, a win and a clean sheet to go with it. So we're happy with that. Yeah, had to be uh, Tevez today for the Man of the Match award. Yeah, he was really good. He got a goal for himself. Um, and he hit the post early on. He, I, I, like I say, Mutu only got a six. I know Mutu... Well, I mean, he didn't play as much time as Tevez there um, in the end, but like I thought Tevez overall to the to the point where Mewtwo came off was overall better. But uh, yeah, if he didn't get that goal though near the end, though, it looks like it would have been Pedretti today. 
So I'm wondering if that goal just pushed it over the line for Tevez to claim it today. But Pedretti was really good. To be honest, I thought all our players at the back were really good today. There was one or two moments that were a bit scary. Carini pulling off that good save near the end as well. The, um, Asati, a yeah, six. He wasn't too bad. Hoekstra was good. Uh, Puello was in attacking midfield today. He, he, he wasn't too bad, but he wasn't too amazing either, admittedly. Um, Rubina came on and got a, uh, a uh, late assist. So, yeah, we're happy. So, fixture 11 results. Yeah, Liverpool did win 2 0 over uh, Wigan in the end. So, yeah, Arsenal and Celtic drew 1 1. That is a really good result for Celtic, that one. Uh, Spares lost at Blackburn 2 1. Uh, Chelsea held to a draw against West Ham at home. Middlesbrough lost at Fulham 2 1. Manchester United won at Bolton 4 uh, 2. Everton won at Rangers 1 0. And those are the results. League table is uh, like this then, so not. Uh, any changes in those top six there teams uh, Fulham doing really well this season they're on 17 points West Ham on the uh, 20 there as well so uh, uh, Fulham are in a uh, European position the three points clear of Everton and Bolton there so uh, yeah we're going to move down to the bottom though real quickly because uh, not a lot has really changed this week uh, Spares are down to 14th now same amount of points as Blackburn um, difference is that uh, Spares have scored more goals because the goal difference is exactly the same as well. Uh, Spares have conceded 21 goals this season. Wow. Uh, that's only beaten by um, Rangers there at the bottom and also Middlesbrough. So, yeah, that uh, is that. And uh, Arsenal up to 9th, but they only got a draw today. Wigan down to 10th, Aston Villa down to 11th, uh, Celtic up to 13th now. Um, Rangers remain bottom just on the 5 points. So the Champions League is back again. This is fixture two. In Group A, we've got uh, AC Milan taking on Stuttgart. We've got West Ham at home to Barcelona. That uh, you never know because you, you just never know. But um, I'll tell you what, that I've just had a look and uh, Barcelona have won 11 out of 11 games this season in the Liga. So <laughs> don't think it's going to be a pushover. Uh, but yeah, Chelsea are at Wolfsburg in Group B, and also in that group we've got Bayern, they're at home to Atletico Madrid in Group uh, D, we're going to skip ours for now, we've got Werder Bremen and uh, Valencia, and also Real Madrid are taking on Inter, so very interesting there. In our group there we've got Manchester United at home to Bayernord, whilst we're away at Roma in the next one. So uh, wish us luck with that one, because... Uh, yeah, you never know. You never know what could uh, throw up Roma. I don't think will be a pushover tier. I mean, look at Valencia last season. They um, give us a bit of a kick in. So, uh, you know, we're not going to take it lightly. But, yeah, guys, that was it today. Um, a solid performance. Just the just the two goals today. Um, it's enough to do the job. We'll see you next time. Please do comment, subscribe, and share as always. Take care, guys. See you then.